What is up guys and welcome to the August 2016 version of my Tokyo Treat unboxing. Alright, and as I as always I forgot my knife, but I just ripped it apart like this because I'm a boss. And since I'm not stupid anymore, well, I think that is well that's not true. But the book, um, I totally forgot this in my last two videos, but the book actually tells you what the stuff is. So I can let you know. And oh. Oh, okay. This uh thing that the wasabi potato chips might not be able to enter the country. Okay, that's okay. So the first up is Toro Tito from um, Meiji, who I've seen quite a bit before. Um, looks like there's some kind of like caramel filling or something like that. So let's look it up in the book, shall we? Um, Torado chocolate mango flavor. Although I probably should read this afterwards, so I get, so I actually get surprised by what's in here. So okay, I won't look at it anymore until afterwards, I guess. So. Yeah, it's time for me to get fatter. No. I do gotta lose weight. I do work out, but... It runs in my family, and I have a bad back, so that doesn't help. But... Oh, they're all messed up. But... Oh, that's weird. Oh, they're... They're hard, and they do smell like a mango, but they look like a crouton. Salad crouton. They're soft. And gross. Oh. I don't like mango. I'm a big fan. Probably shouldn't talk with a mouthful. Hmm. I'm not a big fan of that kind of tropical flavor, especially that kind of stuff mixed with chocolate. That's why I have this water here, just in case there's something I don't like. Okay, well. It's not the worst thing ever. The worst thing I got in the Tokyo Street Box is that squid jerky. Next up, oh, polar bear watermelon tree. There's a polar bear there. But, uh, uh watermelon gummy seems like by Kabaya. Yeah. So, where are those? At? Okay, those are right there. So, I'll read those afterwards. Mm. Smells not great, but I don't really like the. I don't like watermelon that much, actually. I know everybody's gonna hate me. Ooh, I think they're sour because there's a lot of sugar on it. Not sour, but not bad. Mm. Ooh, it's a resealable bag, too. Cool. So I wanna eat these all in one setting. Maybe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> not bad. I mean, it's a gummy watermelon. So those are watermelon flavored gummies, what it's called. <laughs> okay, well. Next up. <clears throat> Oh. Oh, they look like, um, not peanuts. I don't remember what those are called, if you can see the picture. But at the bottom it says, milk and coffee tastes. So I know what they are, so. Mujipan milk coffee chocolate flavor. The picture's different, but the same thing. Okay. Hmm. Milk, coffee, and chocolate flavor. I don't know why I keep looking over there. The camera's right there. Yeah, I know I'm kind of wearing this flat bill hat. I actually have own a couple flat bill hats, just because the way that's the way I bought them, and I didn't want to like mess them up by bending them. And I know it's EA Sports. Don't hate me. This was this was the closest hat to me, so I just grabbed it. <laughs> I got it for NFL 13 or something like that. Oh, those are those are good. I know oh, I know what those are. It's um honey. They're Honey Smacks. The cereal Honey Smacks with the frog. I think they're in a red box. I don't really like the cereal. I used to. But when you put it in a bowl, it gets so sugary. It's just too sweet. I don't like stuff that's too sweet. But, oh my god, those are really good. What, uh... what I say the company was? Mujipan. That's what I thought. Because a lot of the stuff you can find on Amazon... And that's my plan. Like, I'm going to buy, like, my last one I got the shrimp crackers. I'm going to buy, like, a huge thing of shrimp crackers because those things were awesome. You can find a lot of cool stuff on, a lot of these Japanese stuff on, um, uh, Amazon. And, oh, 
that honey and butter? A picture of honey and butter potato chips? It looks like. I see the honey, and it looks like butter next to it. Uh, Nabisco. It's the it's the company Nabisco. Wow. I got those like milk flavored potato chips last time. They were okay. I actually still have the bag just sitting. <laughs> open. They're probably all stale now. They were okay, but I mean, it was weird. They had actually had, like, calcium in there and stuff, too. So, these are... Okay, so, yeah, the, it was supposed to be the wasabi flavor, which would have been really cool. Um, I mean, these are cool, too, by Calbee, but I guess they weren't done... They weren't able to send those. Uh, they have this in here. Um, yeah, honey butter chips. Yeah, it says the potato chip summer version with hobby flavor does not meet U.S. custom standards. Huh, I wonder why. I don't know. Yeah, whatever. These might be. These might be good though. My hands are all greasy. I'm not eating that stuff. But. Oh, I just said a bad word. I'm sorry. Okay, we're just opening like this. I don't think I swear in these, but that time I did. It just, I don't know, it just came out, because I do that a lot. Okay, you want to be a piece of crud. It mostly smells just like butter. Interesting, and then you get the smell of a potato chip. So. Oh, it broke. <laughs> okay. My DualShock 4 controller has been disconnected. No, I need to watch Markiplier. This one. That's what I have on the TV. <laughs> get a lot of the butter flavor in that. It's not bad. It's actually not bad. Uh, barely, I didn't get much honey, but you can taste the butter. And I mean, I'm not a big fan of like the butter by itself, but with the crunch of the potato chip and like the added saltiness to the potato chip and a little bit of honey, honey, it's not too bad. But like, I'm not a big, not a big fan of like butter. I mean, I like by itself. I like butter on like my toast and stuff like that, but. Like, people deep-fry butter. And then last, and finally, uh, pretz. It just says pretz. <laughs> uh, looks like they're just, um, regular, like, pretzel sticks. Or, like, a sesame seed stick. Which, those are always good. The book closed on me. It's not like it's that. Uh, it's like the second page. Oh, yeah. Okay, I think that's butter, too. Because it sure tastes like something. It tastes like butter or something. Um, oh, it's honey. Pret's honey roast flavor. Probably have the butter from those on my hand. Yeah, Pret's honey roast flavor. Oh, those are pretty decent. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Sucks that we weren't able to get the wasabi potato chips, but happy I got these. These aren't bad. Um, <clears throat> liked everything except for those... Um, mango chocolate, but I'm not a big fan of stuff like that. A lot of people, other people probably are, but. So that's it for this edition of Tokyo Treat. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see more of my content, why not, why not subscribe, and it would be much appreciated. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.